from NBC News, this is Today. Chances are you've cracked open a can of Chef Boyardee at one time or another. The pasta has been a staple on grocery store shelves now for 80 years. And unlike Betty Crocker and Mrs. Paul, the chef was actually a real guy. Three guys, brothers. And now their great niece wants you to know there is more to them than what's in the can. Hello, may I come in? I am Chef Boyardee. This is the real chef behind the friendly face that lines many a supermarket shelf. Hector Boyardee, one of three brothers who started the company in 1928 after customers at their Cleveland restaurant started asking for take-home portions. They spelled the name phonetically Boyardee, but it still became Americanized. And while her ancestors introduced many Americans to Italian food in the 30s by making it widely accessible, Anna wants to introduce her peers to an equally foreign concept, cooking at home. I think people either never learned or they are intimidated. She made me the newest student in an informal class she holds at her apartment. I know, I'm like, how do I tie this? <laughs> I wear an apron so often. So you want to cut it into florets. We cook pasta, of course, and sea bass. You peel the garlic yes. before you chop it, right? And even though heating up a can is easier, it didn't take too long to be rewarded for our efforts. Bon appetit. I feel like I am doing a service and honoring sort of my family tradition. Thank goodness for Chef We're gonna cook today. What cook. are we going to cook? Well, pie, not pizza. Pie. So today we're here at Hip Cooks, which is an awesome cooking school in Los Angeles, and we are gonna be cooking with Ming and Aoki, although I don't think we're gonna do any real cooking today. We're just sort of gonna get them used to the idea of being in the kitchen. So Anna is the living little baby junior chef for RD. I wanna make chicken or pasta. Ming and Aoki decided today that they would like to try to cook a whole meal for their mom, which is so sweet. It's such an act of love. Here, you look messy. Mac. No. What's this? Is this your hair? No, it's not hair. What is it? It's hair. Some New York socialites are tired of going to the best restaurants. They're actually learning to cook at home. There was this generation of girls that sort of lost the art. Enter 34-year-old Anna Boyardi, hostess of Cucina Academy and granddaughter of Chef Boyardi, the man responsible for introducing the masses to pasta in a can in 1928. I do think it's becoming chic to cook. Today, Anna with business partner Lorenzo Uros introducing the concept of the home-cooked meal to the social masses. How simple it doesn't need to be for the socialite to grasp the concept. <laughs> Fira, <laughs> what are you trying to say? Simple enough that her lessons have inspired members of the upper crust to send their help home and, chop chop, get their hands dirty.